Therefore, the only election that makes sense in our place right now in Biafra land is a referendum. When we achieve a referendum, then all these nice things that people like OB is talking about, how he's going to revive the economy and how he's going to put people to work, those are beautiful things to say. But for you to be able to implement those things, you have to have a just society to be able to do that. You have to be able to have people that are, are ready to receive the opportunity and want to participate to make their life better. You don't have that right now. What is Peter be going to do with millions of armageries? How is he going to control the military? How is he going to control all the terrorist groups from the north? The banditries. Mieti Allah. Fulani Hotsmen. That are the fourth most deadliest terrorist group in the world. By Global Watch on terrorism. And Saru, Ashabab, how is an evil president going to control these terrorist groups? How is that going to happen? So the first thing is to secure our, 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 our life first, before anything else. And the only way to do that is through a referendum. You have to be alive to participate in an election. Right now, our struggle has gone beyond economies. It's gone beyond a way of life. We are fighting for self-preservation at this point. Self-preservation. We are fighting to stay alive. And every Biafra should be able to see that. If you do not see that, you see that you are nonchalant, you don't care, or you are desperately wicked, one or the other. There is no other explanation. Thank you.